Hi everyone. It's so nice to be with you again. I hope you guys are doing well. Today, we are going to be reviewing rhythm and going over percussion instruments. So let's review rhythm. If you have not seen my video from last week, please make sure to check it out first so that you can be caught up on what we are doing. So let's review those two notes from last week. Let's see if you remember. So I'm gonna draw one line. Do you remember how to say that? You say, ta. I'm gonna draw another line. So right now I have ta, ta. Now let me draw those connected lines. So I have two lines that are connected right at the top. You say T, T. And then let's finish this rhythm off by drawing one line. So right now I have this rhythm. Repeat after me. Ta, ta, T, T, ta. Great job. So I'm gonna write another rhythm on this board. Let's see if you can say it. Let's do the connected lines first. How do you say this? T, T. And then a single line, ta. Let's do the connected lines again. Followed by a single line, just like this. So let's see if you can read this. Repeat after me. T, T, ta, T, T, ta. Awesome job. Now I'm gonna teach you something brand new. We're gonna learn a new note. So I'm gonna start off by writing the notes that we already know. So let's do ta, t, t, and then this. Followed by ta. So you do not know this note right here. This is actually called a rest. How we say it is shh. Can you say that with me? Shh. So this rhythm would be said like this. Ta, t, t, shh, ta. Can you repeat after me? Ta, t, t, shh, ta. Great job. So let's write some more rhythms with that rest. So when I write the notes, see if you can say them. Connected lines. Connected lines again. Do you remember how to say that? followed by ta. Are you able to say this? Repeat after me. T, 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 sh, ta. Awesome. All right, let's do one more rhythm. I'm gonna write it on here. See if you can say it. Right. Are you able to say this one? How about you say it with me? Ready, go. Ta, sh, t, t, sh. Were you able to say that? If, if you were, good job. If not, we are still learning how to do this. I promise you, we will get it. 
So I have my drum here. I'm going to show you how to play different rhythms and how to play the rhythms with the rests in them. So I'm going to play a rhythm that has a rest. I want you to watch exactly how I play that. Ta, ta, sh, ta. Do you see how I did not make any sound on my instrument during the sh? Watch again. Ta, ta, sh, ta. So anytime there is one of those sh, you do not make any sound clapping or playing that in any way. So practice rhythms at home. You can write them out and make your own using ta, tt, and sh. So now we're going to start going over some percussion instruments. There are three categories that we're going to learn about. We are going to learn about instruments that shake, instruments that you hit to make a sound, and instruments that you scrape. So we'll go over some instruments that fit under those categories. So that first category was shake. I have instruments right here. These are called maracas and you shake them to make a sound. Listen. Do you have something in your house that you can shake to make a sound? I bet you do. See if you can find one. The second category is hit. I have a drum right here that I have to hit to make a sound. Do you have something in your house that you can hit to make music on? I bet you do. See if you can find one. The last category is scrape or rub. So I have these instruments right here. These are called sand blocks and you rub them to make a sound. It sounds like this. Now this one's kind of tricky. Is there something in your house that you can scrape or rub to make music on? See if you can find one of those. Now those three categories we talked about were shake, hit, and scrape or rub. I bet you have items around your house that you can make music on that fit under those three categories. If you would like to send me pictures of items you found around the house that you can make music on or rhythms that you made, feel free to email me and I hope I hear from you. So that's it for music today. We will continue to review rhythm and learn about new instruments next time. I miss all of you and I can't wait to see you soon. Bye everyone.